I'm about to go on the radio. Crack on. Okay, behind this busy road is a busy building. That building behind me is BBC Radio Gloucestershire. And uh, if you've watched some of my videos over the years, every now and then I do pop up on local radio, uh, Radio Bristol. I've, I have been on Radio 4 actually uh, before now, and uh, Radio Gloucestershire. So today I'm up here, I'm talking a little bit about my calendar, a bit about the vlogging about Hartbury College. They did mention something about it's Will Soil uh, Health Day, so I don't know whether I'm going to have a chat about that or not. But basically, I'm going to go in the studio there in a minute, um, and I'm going to be in the radio studio with a presenter called Kate Clark, who um, I've known of for a few years now. She's really good, actually. I, I do like her. She's enthusiastic. Um, she's got a lot of knowledge of the countryside. Um, and every now and then we bump into each other and we have a bit of fun actually. Um, but I've also asked if I can do a little bit of filming. Now it's not always easy to film inside someone like a radio studio because they've got a job to do. You know if they're presenting they can't have me asking questions and things like that. So I will try and do a little bit of video inside but it might not be the whole thing. Um, we'll have a look at the building before I go in. It's quite funny. I never go in the front door. I always go in the tradesman centre, it's around the back, and it's quite funny, there's a nice prestigious building, but because um, I'm here on the weekend, I don't think it's all open, so I end up going down the tradesman's entrance. We'll have a look at that. I'm gonna just go and do a bit of video around the outside, and then we'll go in, all right? All right, here's the building. Intercom on there. We're not using the current situation, right. Radio. So we're gonna go around the back. I always go around the back. We've got a car park around the back, which we can go and see. Yeah, I'm walking around the back now. This is the unglamorous side of Radio Gloucester. I think, uh, you can see behind me it says TV reporter on the wall. I think some of the local uh, TV news use this as a base as well. I'll have to find out actually, because it's a big building just for radio, but I'm pretty sure they base the local Gloucestershire reporter here. Look. And here we are, here's the BBC cars. Look at this, the glamour station vehicle. BBC BBC So there we are travel presenter breakfast presenter early producer and King she must be important she's got her own thing early BA Oh look let's have a look You got they all got their name places late BA late producer late bulletins Early bulletins. Hang on, what's this one? Drive, drive. And uh, so the, there's no, <laughs> there's no one for the funky farmer. But I am in. Look, BBC visitor behind. Right, I'm going to go in. I've got to wear a mask in there. Um, we'll just get ourselves. I'll go down the corridor in a minute. I've just got to get a few bits out of the car, and then we'll go in. Actually, do you know what? Glad to get inside. It's blooming cold out here. Look, there's the glamorous back entrance. Beep. Oh, you watch me up there. Hello, can I help you? Hiya, it's Rich Cornock for Kate Clark. Okay. I'll just take this off because there's no one about. Right, I'm in the studio. Look at this. I could. Oh, I might have to wait until uh, the music stops. I can see him. He's doing his video as we speak. There he is. He's giving me a wave. <laughs> He's uh, she's just talking about me. Wow. Right, I don't know whether you can hear what she's saying, but basically, um, well, let's get away from that speaker. So, I first guest in the studio for a couple of years, but um, that's nice. I can only film when she's talking, really, because of the copyright of the music, which is a bit of a problem. So, she's playing radio music. I can't film it when the music's playing, otherwise, it'll get pinged up for copyright on YouTube. So, let's have a quick look. You might hear a chat behind. 
So control room in there. Can we see the control room? Look, they're all busy in there. Once you've saved us in your contacts, send us a message. Start your message with the word GLOSS, G-L-O-S. I just had to do a temperature test before I came in and I've got a mask up when I go in and see her but um, nice to be back in a radio studio because it's always quite a cosy environment it's always quite a nice place to be I find and you can have a chat we could have done this over zoom but to be honest that's you know you lose a bit of something um, so we're gonna have a chat uh, let me just turn this off we'll, we'll see her when we're in the studio but you get the idea you basically I've basically come in there's a control room there, and behind it are two radio studios, one and two, I think. And she's in one. So, um, so one is there, and two is there. So basically what they do is, there's always someone in one of the studios broadcasting, and someone will be broadcasting in that one. And then they've got a second one, which I guess, if in an emergency, they use that as their backup if the first one broke down. But also, when you change presenters, you don't want to have to keep running in and pushing someone out of the way. So when the next show is on, I think they swap over to that other studio. Right, anyway, I'm in Studio One with Kate. We'll be in in a bit. I'm in the studio. I've got one minute, apparently. Here's Kate. Hello. All right, you're looking Hi. good. Hi. Are you ready for a Funky Farmer chat? I'm ready for a Funky Farmer chat. Brilliant. This is this is so nice to be here in the studio actually again. Isn't it? I've been honoured. Apparently, I'm the first guest in about You're two years. You're my first guest in, how, in two years. How good is yeah. that? So, so actually, real life guest here in the studio. Right. It's a bit strange because I'll sit down now. I might so just come around and film you around here you in a minute. You can do that. Yeah. Bit, I've got 40 seconds oh. and then I have to chit chat. Oh, a bit oh, 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 oh. <laughs> it's breaking the furniture. <laughs> It's all a bit posh, isn't it? I'm not used to things like this. <laughs> look at this, look, look, you've got microphones, look, you've got look, everything. This is where we get our um, messages in. Oh, right. oh you see, you see what people are sending you. That people send. I heard that, it's a new thing for yeah, you, isn't it? It's, it's new for us. New WhatsApp. for WhatsApp, but it's a brilliant way of communicating. Right, I've got to talk right. for 20 seconds. Oh, shut up. <laughs> Soon it is the funky farmer, otherwise known. Well, otherwise known as the funky farmer. Sometimes he's called Richard Cornock, perhaps. But, you know, maybe his mum still calls him Richard, but everybody else calls in the Funky Farmer and he's uh, going to be chatting to us next. But first of all, it's another Christmas tune for you. We're seriously getting in the mood today. It's Kylie Minogue and Santa Baby here on BBC Radio Gloucestershire. It's been six or seven years ago. It was still pretty much in its infancy, wasn't it? Do you remember? It's a bit weird. I mean, I think it's, it's all developed over time and stuff. We've got the calendar and, uh, yeah, if, well. you want, if you want a calendar, go on <laughs> richardcornock.co.uk oh, and you go. go to the shop and you can buy a calendar or just Google Funky Farmer calendar. Just Google Funky Farmer. Not many left. YouTube as well and you'll find them. Richard, thank you. And I should say, you're the first person I'm going to say this to. Merry Christmas. Oh, Merry Christmas to you, Kate. Awesome, brilliant. Right. Do you want me to film you? I've done it. I've I'm going to be on, on the radio. What I'm going to do is I'm going to edit in. I'll do the diversity question and then, okay. <laughs> I'm going to edit in the radio bit over a couple of oh, still we're photographs. On donut audio as well. That's not in yet. Right. <laughs> See what I mean? I told you it was busy. You can't really spend a lot of time <laughs> filming. What I'm going to do is I'll edit in a bit over a still photograph because because that was easier. But before I do that, I'm just going to have a chat with Kate. She's going to show. Okay, yeah, I can see that. Bear with for a <laughs> That's my colleague. She keeps on chatting to me, telling me uh, what's happening next. That's Rachel, who's behind the glass. You can just see her working hard. Because you are, it's almost like you're a cockpit. Aren't you? It's like <laughs> a, you know, you're running a, a kind of empire, if you like, or well, something. Well, they do say it's driving the desk. Actually, that's it. Yeah, they say it's driving the desk. So it looks more fancy than I think what it needs to be. What have you got this here then? This is um, where my music is coming from. Right. Can you see that? Yeah. Oh, okay. So that's where my music is yeah. coming from. And then in a minute, we're going to have a guest. Are these are your songs. These are my songs right, coming okay. up. Bit oh, of Ronan Keating, okay. little mix on nice. the way. Um, and over here, that's my fader. Okay. So you fade what? The I mic's would, in and out. I would put it up and down when I need to. Um, okay, so you've got a script. There. Right, okay. This was your script. Oh, okay, so a little see? bit about me. A little bit about you okay, and, your... and what we were going to talk right. about. Lovely. You've got to be prepared, haven't you? That's the main thing with this. You can't just throw it together. Oh, no. you didn't see it in open media on the script, and then uh, I thought, oh, you don't need one. I know, I'm, get, I'm getting told off now. You see. Oh, is that your producer, is My it? My fault, sorry, Rach. That's right, no problem, I'm loading it in for you now, no problem. 
Thank you. So it's all happening, really. Yeah. Richard's done his bit. I have. And now... Um, and now I'm clearing off. And, and now i got to cr- crack on. you got to crack on. you got to crack on. Crack on. You see, it's the best catchphrase ever. Everyone has to crack on. Right. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, to... I'm heading out now. See you soon, guys. That's it. Well, I, I did cobble together a few bits of video, but do you know what? The distraction in there, when you're chatting and doing stuff, it's really difficult to try and do a video, try and... Um, have a chat with someone who's actually working hard on on their keeping the radio uh, thing together uh, they just actually just said to me would you do a, a piece for radio uh, on Christmas Day so it sounds like I'm going to be on Radio Gloss, uh, Radio Gloucestershire on Christmas Day which is a bit of fun isn't it uh, anyway crack on everyone hope you enjoyed what you saw and heard